you took a part of me away. Like we came in this world as three. Like you broke you broke a link to the chain. Like that and that was that that I'm close with all my brothers, but Aaron, I was we was like this. Aaron Lowe was a loved brother, son, and University of Utah football player. A happy soul, someone you could laugh with, talk with. And His death was an unexpected tragedy that shook the whole community. On Monday morning, the Salt Lake County District Attorney's Office announced the defendant, Book Mooth Book, has pleaded guilty. It kind of make it emotional, like, because it kind of feel like I'm living the night that it happened again. I'm, I'm remembering, okay. You know, this my brother really gone. Like this this really this really real. Aaron was killed and another person was injured in a shooting in September of 2021 outside a house party in Sugar House, just hours after the Utes defeated Washington State at Rice Eccles Stadium. The woman he was with was hospitalized in critical condition with gunshot wounds to the neck and chest. She has never been identified. Book pleaded guilty to one count of first degree felony murder and one count of first degree felony attempted murder. It's imperfect justice. Uh, it is a accountability uh, and it's a severe accountability. Uh, and uh, it's something, you know, uh, which is appropriate. Uh, the defendant in this matter, uh, you know, if you look at the matrix, uh, you know, hopefully we'll spend a very long time uh, in prison for this uh, absolute senseless killing. I spoke to Aaron Lowe, Aaron's brother. I got one of his jackets right here as uh, we speak, and another. <laughs> That's another. Who wants the punishment to be harsher? In my in my mind, in my heart, you took my brother. Like, and my brother, my brother was an unarmed man, and you shot him. You, he was an unarmed man. He was no threat to you. You could have walked away. You was across the street and he was on the other side. You could have just walked away, turned your back and went the other way. Instead, you chose to take his life that night. Book sentencing is scheduled for April 29th. Aaron's family says they hope this sends a message so that no other family has to deal with heartbreak or tragedy like this. At the University of Utah, I am Mike Tilly Fox 13 News, Utah.